we're going to talk about animals you can find on board a ship. For the Masabi Miner, we have dogs. Dogs are handles found mostly on watertight doors used to clamp the door closed against its rubber gasket in order to form a watertight seal. We have spiders on board. Spiders are a metal cage-like structure with a winch on it where deckhands or crew members can get in it, hoist themselves up in the air to access the high places on the ship for maintenance purposes, painting, or whatnot. We have fish plates on board. Fish plates are a triangular piece of steel with either a cable or a chain attached in each corner. These are used for lifting or towing bridles. We have pelican hooks. Pelican hooks are, are a hook that has a hinge on it that opens up. You put something inside of it, close it, and it gets secured at the top with a ring. You can use these to release whatever you have it hooked to while the, it's still under strain. We have pipe poles. Pike poles are similar to boat hooks, if you know what a boat hook is. The difference being on a pike pole, the pointy end is pointed and the end of the hook is pointed. It's on a long pole and it's basically for retrieving things out of the water. We have several animals on the anchor windlass. The anchor windlass is the large machine used to raise and lower the anchor. On the anchor windlass is the Wildcat. The Wildcat is a large gear type device that the anchor chain rides over and the links engage into the teeth of the Wildcat. The Wildcat is driven by the bull gear. The bull gear is connected to the Wildcat. It's driven by the little motor. The motor turns the bull gear and the bull gear turns the Wildcat for raising or lowering the anchor. Also on the anchor is the cat's paw. The cat's paw is a small metal device that rides on the anchor chain as it's coming up through the hawse pipe. And in the event that the anchor windlass would fail, the cat's paw wedges itself in, into the anchor chain links and prevents the anchor from free falling back to the bottom and potentially losing all the anchor chain. Once we have the anchor home, or in its final position for getting underway, we put on the Devil's Claw. The Devil's Claw serves as another safeguard against anchor windless failure and the anchor free falling and potentially losing the chain.